Terms. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Dilettante Ball. I'm Johnny. I'm Spencer. And here on Dilettante Ball, we go on Wikipedia. We learn about the states. And we talk about them. Yeah. But first, we're going to talk about something else. That is our first, uh, the Bug House Theater presents Peaches and Hot Sauce Live presents DilettanteBallLive.com. <laughs> presents um, the <laughs> Doritos, Tacos, Locos, Super Bowl Halftime Power Hour. <laughs> Brought to you by Old Navy. And Chick-fil-A, <laughs> home of the chicken sandwich. We didn't invent the chicken sandwich. We just invented chicken. <laughs> um, we're doing a live show on... Can we make that the full proper... It is now. Okay. Uh, May 14th, which is this Thursday it's, yeah, it's at right 10 now. p.m. Come on out. It's going to be... Not only will it be a hoot, it'll be a holler. A hoot and a holler, you say? So it's at the Bug House Theater in Chicago, Illinois. Right off the sunny brown line stop, Irving Park. Uh, the sunny you, you said that in the perfect order <laughs> um so i'm come, new in town come out it'll be great it'll be great what state do you think is next uh, oregon no that's that can't be i don't think it's true i'm just going with my gut uh so last week we had louisiana i'm gonna say mississippi another one of those territories on there i'm gonna say missouri missouri okay you're going up the guy's body mm-hmm. What do we got? Indiana. Indiana. Home of the brave. Um, and the few. Indiana Territory. Former name. December 11th, 1816. So that's four years later. Okay. Maybe we're picking up the pace a little Maybe. bit. Maybe. Uh, bef- I just clicked into the article, but I'm going to say right now, I feel like I hate Indiana straight up. I feel like I do too, and I feel like this article is going to make up for it, though. I don't know. Uh, also, they... <sighs> Whatever, uh, their flag, just a torch it's and some a lot stars. Stuck on. Yeah, don't really like it. Feels very messy. Yeah. And why? Are, why? Are, I don't even. I don't want to. I don't want to discuss it that much. It, it looks like shit. It looks like um, it looks like a design that they proposed at the the meeting of the first Olympics. Like, what's the Olympics logo going to be? Um, let's get um, let's get a torch and four hundred stars. <laughs> no, how about five rings? Yeah, that makes sense, I guess. But can we have each one be a different color? Fine. Yeah, cool. Can we also have uh, 300 stars? <laughs> Just circles and 300 stars. Uh, Meet me in the middle. Their seal is... Wow, that's a lot of stuff going on. a lot going on on this, too. This a, is bad. A buffalo or a bison, there's a difference, and only one lives here, and I don't know which one. Um, jumping over a log. The quick brown buffalo jumped over the lazy log. <laughs> and... And there's a man Chopping murdering a down tree. A tree. And there's uh, some hills in the background. The sun. The hills look like a butt, and the sun looks like a butthole. That is true. Ugh. So look that up. Yeah, this is not. Great. I think the buffalo's being killed somehow. He's like falling into like a, a spike yeah, trap. Well, or something. when I first saw it, I thought he was oh, prone. Fuck. Yeah. Uh, prone to leave the state. Nicknames the Hoosier State. Yeah, okay, I don't even know what a Hoosier is. I'm not gonna look it up. I do remember that. It's named for that movie. My, I was gonna say my my grandparents or great grandparents, I suppose. Not, I don't suppose they are, were. Um, they're dead. They, <laughs> I re- vividly remember they only had one, uh, VHS that they bought, and everything else was like taped off TV. It's Hoosiers. It was Hoosiers, and I never saw them watch it. Never heard them talk about <laughs> it. That was the one tape that they had. I was hoping you were gonna. I thought you were gonna say they had one bumper sticker and it just said "Win one for the Gipper." I don't know what that means. It's from the movie Hoosiers. I've never seen that. Neither have I. Uh, and they're not from Indiana or, or remotely close to Indiana. I feel Indiana. like Hoosiers was just a good movie. Yeah, well, never see it. You know, so it's like, know. you know, uh, Field of Dreams or something. Sure. Like that level of like. Motto, the crossroads of America. Really? I don't that feel that like I agree. Missouri. It does feel like Missouri. Or you could even say, I wouldn't, but you could even say it's Promontory, Promontory Point in Utah. Why would you say that? That's where the Transatlantic Railroad met. Oh, with the gold spike? Mm-hmm. From Wild Wild West. Yeah. Yeah, that's a cool movie, right? Um, official language, English. Spoken languages, English, Spanish. Other languages. Demonym, Hoosier. Mm-hmm. They're just called Hoosiers. I have no that's idea where that comes from. Maybe we'll learn where it comes from today. I'm not going to click that article, so. <laughs> capital, Indianapolis, real yep. original. <laughs> oh, hey, what's the capital of Florida? Oh, Florida. Florida-opolis. Yeah. Texas, Texopolis. Indianapolis Opoly. I was just going to fucking say that. I was going to say the Indianapolis licensed uh, Milton Bradley board game. Is it Milton Bradley? Uh, Parker Brothers. Who cares? Oh, my God. 
Area 38th, population 16th. Okay. It's a little higher than I expected it to be. Highest point, Hoosier Hill. Come on, guys. <laughs> Lowest point, Hoosier Valley. Yeah, right. no. <laughs> um, confluence of Ohio River and Wabash River. Okay, so no no proper answer. Before statehood, Indiana Territory. Blah, blah, blah. Governor Mike Pence. They're fucking up, too, with the... With the um, can't buy pizza if you're gay, man. Oh, is that is that Indiana? Are they doing yeah. that shit? Yeah, it's like it's like businesses are just allowed to be like, no, you're gay. Get okay, the fuck it'll be fourteen ninety five. Uh, I do have one question though for you first. Uh, are you gay? Are you are you two gentlemen gay together? Uh, yes, gay. No, not together. We're just we're gay, but we're just friends. Ooh, that feels like a pretty good loophole. Okay, here's your pizza. <laughs> 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 Woo. <laughs> um, yeah, we're just friends. I don't know. Okay, state symbols: this shitty ass flag, this shitty ass seal. The bird, cardinal, fish, largemouth bass. Dude, cardinal and largemouth bass are the two, like, like brook trout. Like, who cares? Yeah, flowers, peony, not mm. peyote. <laughs> tree, tulip tree. That's, that's not, not, not tree. real. That's not real. <laughs> Beverage. Coca-Cola. Water. <laughs> oh, our state food is air. <laughs> our state beverage. Water isn't a beverage. It's- our s- our state foundation is the ground. <laughs> Our state air is 78% nitrogen, 21% oxygen, 3% state, other. State colors, blue and gold. This isn't a high school. This is a fucking state. State colors. State firearm. I'm um, sorry. The what? I hope <gasps> what? it's something crazy. Like The actual fuck. I hope it's like a 50 caliber sniper rifle. Grouseland rifle. I don't know what a Grouseland rifle is. Me neither. I mean, it's a rifle. Is that so... a, a rifle that describes the type of game that you hunt? Grouseland? Or is Grouseland the name of the manufacturer? Dennis like a... Grouseland. I don't know. Yeah, you know. State firearm? I'm surprised it's taken. Our state method of execution is uh, it's lethal injection. Our state method is drawing and quartering. Fuck. State food? Sugar cream pie? <laughs> <laughs> Take our grassland rifles out and get some sugar cream pie. <laughs> state mineral is coal. Okay, this place is so whack. Motto: The Crossroads of America. The state poem is Indiana. State poem, huh? State rock: Salem limestone. Who cares? State ships. Uh, what? The USS Indianapolis and the USS Indiana. Okay, no surprises there. State soil is Miami. Miami. Yeah. Uh, the state song, the official state song is On the Banks of the Wabash, Far Away. The unofficial state song is Back Home Again in Indiana. The state sport is basketball. Yeah, that's the, the Hoosiers play basketball, I think. Is that the name of the team? You don't know. I'm asking the wrong person. This state sucks. It sucks, but in like a very white bread American sort of way. Yes, yes, yes. Water? Like, in Indiana is like... Before every other state decided what their deal was, like you start out as Indiana, and then you're like, okay, this is like this Indiana's is like tabula, tabula rasa. Yeah, okay, we'll get some we'll get some French influence. Okay, okay we're Louisiana. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> uh, w- can we be dope as fuck? Okay, you're Rhode Island. Yeah, uh, yeah, uh, we're good. <laughs> Are you sure you can literally do anything you want? No, we're fine. Okay, you're <laughs> Indiana, I guess. What's your capital? Oh, Indiana. <laughs> Apolis. <laughs> Indiana Apolis. That's our capital. Because it's our name, but then city. It's Indiana City. Do you get it? Yeah, it's like they got caught off guard on the day of the exam. <laughs> like, all right, this is for uh, you know, all the, f- the future. What's your state beverage? Fuck. Uh, uh, water. 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 Fuck. Okay. Uh, it's water, I guess. Right now. <laughs> what do you, um, what's your demonym? Who's, uh, who's your asking? Who- who's your asking? <laughs> okay, who's your? Okay. Fuck. What? What does that mean? I don't know. Slap on everything. We'll figure it out eventually. Uh, it's a U.S. state located in the Midwestern and Great Lakes regions of North America. It's the 38th largest, 16th most populous. Capital is Indianapolis. It was in man, blee, blee, before becoming a territory. Excuse me. Before becoming a territory, varying cultures of indigenous peoples and historic Native Americans inhabited Indiana for thousands of years. Uh, since its founding as a territory... Settlement patterns in Indiana have reflected regional cultural segmentation present in the eastern United States. The state's northernmost tier was settled prominently by people from New England and New York, central Indiana by migrants from the mid-Atlantic states, and from adjacent Ohio and southern Indiana by settlers from southern states, particularly Kentucky and Tennessee. That's kind of interesting. 
I, I, I fell asleep. What'd you say? Uh, basically, Indiana was settled by people from the East Coast, but basically just shrunk down. So, like, N- New England is in the north of Indiana, the Mid Atlantic oh. is in the middle, and the South is in the South. Uh, that is kind of interesting, actually. Yeah. Uh, isn't it weird? Like, can you imagine? I bet if Indiana had remained, like, let's say that. <laughs> okay, this is going to be a pretty crazy oh God. hypothetical. Imagine that North America had never been discovered by uh, like European settlers or whatever, sure. and you and we're and but other than that, it's been the same. But so instead of being like Irish or whatever, you and I are like Cherokee or something, and we're on, we're reading the Wikipedia about Indiana, and it's like wow, Indiana is awesome because of like all the cool hair like culture of the like you know native population that used to be there, and then they got wiped out and you know moved away and. And now it's this, like a shitty... What would even happen if Europeans never came here? How fucking crazy would that be? We'd already be on Mars. Like, something insane. Like Oh, uh, just like bu- the so butterfly advanced. affected. We, I would have no arms. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, man. I don't know. I don't have a good answer for you. Yeah, I mean, it would... Who knows? Who I, knows? Yeah. W- w- what a stupid question to ask. Because it just <laughs> is, like, so crazy. It's like, yeah, a good question. I don't know. What if... Right. What if I was really a dog... <laughs> Huh? That'd be crazy, right? <laughs> what if water was poison? And, and but you still had to drink it to stay alive. <laughs> what, what, what would we even do? <sighs> I'm an idiot. Indiana has a diverse economy with a gross state product of 298 billion. That doesn't feel like a lot. Yeah. In 2012. Uh, it has several metropolitan areas with populations greater than 100,000 and a number of smaller industrial cities and towns. It's home to several major sports teams and athletic events, including the NFL's Indianapolis Colts, the NASL's Indy 11. I'm sorry, the what? NASL. I have no idea what that is. Me neither. Not going to look North it up. North American Soccer League? Probably. That doesn't seem like a thing. The NBA's Indiana Pacers, the WNBA's Indiana... Lady Pacers, I need to no, go, no. fever. <clears throat> oh, the uh, <laughs> Lady is, Pacers. I feel like that's a thing, though, a lot of places. Like, like, like high schools or yeah. whatever. But, yeah, the lady, the lady Golden no, Tigers. No, still the Golden Tigers. Yeah. No, go back to any, how was Okay, so they had the football team, mm-hmm. a, te- a thing I've never heard of, mm-hmm. and third was the basketball team. Yeah. So this is a basketball state. Mm-hmm. That I feel will, like Hoosiers are the, the college it team. It is a college team. Go back to the NASL thing. What is it? Indy 11. I, I so desperately need to know what that is. I, not finding out. I on know the air. it sucks. It's a rule. We can't actually learn anything. <laughs> that is the one rule of this podcast. How it's weird! A thing I've never heard of. Um, and the Indianapolis Five Hundred and the Brickyard Four Hundred Motorsport Races. Okay. Oh, you into the Crazy Frog song? The what? <laughs> crazy Frog song. <laughs> yes. Uh. Oh, God damn it. What happened? The state's name obviously means Land of the Indians or simply oh, Indian didn't Land. Think about that. So their capital is Indian Land City. <laughs> Get out of here. This is our town now. This is Indian Land City, and we live here. You're not Indians. Well, neither are we. Ha <laughs> ha, gotcha. <laughs> uh, but really, leave. <laughs> uh, it also stems from Indiana's territorial history. No, nothing. That's just a no explanation. Just a dangling <laughs> sentence there. On May seventh, eighteen hundred, the United States Congress passed legislation to divide the Northwest Territory into two areas and name the western s- name the western section the Indiana Territory. In eighteen sixteen, when Congress passed an enabling act to begin the process of establishing statehood for Indiana, part of its territorial land became the geographic area for the new state. Oh, a resident of Indiana is known as a Hoosier. The etymology of this word is disputed, but the leading theory... <laughs> how do we not know? Yeah. It wasn't that long ago. Yeah. But the leading theory, as advanced by the Indiana Historical Bureau and the Indiana Historical Society... I feel like they could probably merge. <laughs> has Hoosier originating from Virginia, the Carolinas, and Tennessee. Okay. A part of the upland southern region of the United States. Yes, I know. As a term for a backwoodsman, a rough countryman, or a country bumpkin. What? How weird. A Hoosier. Look at that Hoosier. Uh, <laughs> Look at that Hoosier up in the hills. Sure, God, we ain't Hoosiers. <laughs> We're the Hoosiers. Wait, and this is Indian land. <laughs> do, do you think, maybe it came from like, who's your, I don't even know, dude. I don't know. Who, is, know. who is your. Who is your brother? Who is, yeah. Because he's also your dad. You're, exactly, exactly. Uh, okay, this next history section 
the the first little subsection of history is aboriginal inhabitants is that the right word for native people? people? I believe it might be based on no prior knowledge. I, f- I always thought it was specific to Australia. Australia. Maybe Australia. Or maybe they're the only place that like properly. Got, right. Because we didn't colonize Australia. Or we And so like 18, you know, whatever. Right. Maybe. I have literally no. Yeah, fucking I don't clue. Know. Anyway, the point is the reason why, the only reason we call them Indians is because. Right, 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 right. Idiots. So, oh, this is India. We made it. Like, no, you didn't. You're not even close. So by the time they got to Australia, they're like, look, we know this isn't India or anywhere else. Like, we know this is Australia. No, this is India. Well, this is Mexico. No, this is India. (laughs) No, it's Jamaica. This is India. It's Bolivia. This is India. This is France. You're right next door. You walked all the way around. You traveled 23,000 miles to get here. Is it India? (laughs) No, it's France still. I know you. Doug, <laughs> this is France. Doug, you're France. It's 1974. <laughs> is this India? Is France, comma India? <laughs> is that a place in India? <laughs> like Paris, Texas? <laughs> Athens, Georgia? St. Petersburg, Florida? <laughs> India, France? New York City, Canada? <laughs> That would be funny. <laughs> Taking American cities and naming them somewhere else. But Do but think, New just New York City. New York City. Just straight up. Do you think that's such a thing somewhere? I mean, probably. Like Albuquerque, you know, Istanbul. Oh, that's really funny. Yeah. Like, see, we can do it too, motherfuckers. <laughs> Steal our city names. Sacramento, England. Right. <laughs> yeah, it feels so silly. Yeah. I don't know. I, New York City would be the best one. Or like... Any like Mexico, Mexico City, United States, or Mexico City, Alabama. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's pretty funny. Fucking funny. Where are you going for uh, spring break? Uh, we're going to Cancun. Oh, that'd be nice. Well, Cancun, Norway. Like, yeah, Cancun, Iceland. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. A lot of gang violence there. Yeah. <laughs> it's weird. Uh, yeah, I'm from uh, Reykjavik. Oh wow. Oh man. Reykjavik, South Africa. <laughs> oh okay. <laughs> it's, a, it's actually a slum. <laughs> it's really dangerous. Uh, still a volcano, though. Yeah. <laughs> Very dangerous <Weirdly. laughs> volcano. Um, it's part of the Circle of Fire. If you could the go. Circle of Fire, Africa. If you could. Going down, down, down into a circle of fire. If you could go anywhere mm-hmm. in the whole world, yeah. real or fake, uh-huh. where would you go? My grave. <sighs> I would go to your grave, too, and rob yeah. it. Oh. What do you think I have in there? What do you think I got buried with? A Game Boy? A ga- which uh, like Game Boy Pocket? Like, now you're playing with yeah, power. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Do you, do you, I recently watched an old Game Boy Pocket commercial from like 1996 or whenever it was. I can remember. I remember it was so cool because they put it in their fucking pockets. <laughs> like, I can remember that and being like, that is so dope. It's red and it fits in your dang pocket. <laughs> fits in your dungarees. It was a. It was like four or five punks, like yes, in the mall, and then they got like slipped so easily into that back pocket. <laughs> well, and then they like ran into like five like old people. It was like move, old man, and the old man was like you young whippersnapper. And then, but they both had like Game Boys, and they're like, all right, and then we're you know playing Game Boys together, like Donkey Kong Country or whatever. God damn it! Now you're playing with power. I actually never had a Game Boy Pocket. I I started with Game Boy Color. Man, um, I started I, with Pocket. That was my first video game. I feel like. Um, just turning it on and yep. looking at Bing! the Nintendo logo. Wow. Um, this is power. When I first got my my original DS, yeah. I got it on Christmas. Okay. I think Jessica got it for me. Wow. But she didn't get me any games. No way. So I just had it. And I, it was Christmas, <laughs> so I couldn't go buy any games. So I was like, this is fucking dope and the best present I've ever gotten. And I can't do shit That's with it. That's amazing. So Jessica's already a mom. Yes. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I got you a game thing. <laughs> look at all the games this has in the background. You like games, right? Look, look at the. Ba- <laughs> you can play all these. Every single one on this picture. Yeah, right the picture on this of the back box. of the box. Yeah. Can you believe it? It came with 12 games. No, it didn't. It didn't come oh, with any games. Uh, I can set the date. <laughs> I made 900 me's right. that day because it was all I could do. It was the worst Christmas ever. <laughs> Ugh. That's really funny, though. It's the thought that counts, you know? No, it's not. It's it not. was miserable. <laughs> and then the day after Christmas is so crowded oh. because everyone's returning their 
their DSs because yeah. they got no games. Can't afford a game. I sold my games to get this DS. <laughs> so I don't even know. I can't finish that. <laughs> um, what did I even? What were we talking about? Game power, playing with power, dude. What would you? Oh, what, oh. What's buried in my grave? Uh, 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 I feel like the Game Boy Color came out a month after the Game Boy Pocket. <laughs> I feel like it was right there. Uh, I don't know about that necessarily, but I feel like it was a few years. It was like ninety. F- I don't know. Who cares? It's a Game Boy Color, man. It's the best thing of all time. Except for Game Boy Advance. Yeah, well, I mean, uh, except for you know, uh, DS. I can't except for that. 3DS. Yeah. You know the when the DS came out? I if, do know this. You know, if people care, which nobody does. Everyone cares. It was, they didn't think it was going to be successful, so they were like, no, this isn't replacing the Game Boy. We're still going to make d- new Game Boys. This is the third pillar of Nintendo. Right. We're going to have consoles, we're going to have handheld consoles, and we're going to have DSs. And what was the difference between a DS and a, uh, the regular handheld? Two screens? Touch screen. Yeah, why? I think I think it was just such a crazy design that they were like, if it doesn't work, we don't want to call it a Game Boy because we don't want to soil the name, the name yeah. of the Game Boy. How so bizarre. That's yeah. so weird. Mm-hmm. And when was the last time a new Game Boy came out? A I mean, long not since time the ago. Advance. The Advance was the last one, I imagine. And the, the <laughs> DS came out in like 2003 or it's, something Yeah, it's been crazy. ages. Yeah, yeah. I don't know, man. I'd love for the new one to be called Game Boy. Just go back to it? Oh, just call it Game Boy? Oh, wow. That, I mean, eventually, I feel like systems are starting to do that. Like, Xbox One. Like, okay, I'm getting and confused. That's only the third one. Yeah. So, I, I don't know. And the third one was called 360. It's like, what? No, the second one. Oh, the second one. I meant the second one. I mean, PlayStation's got unlock. It's like, look, just yes. sort of. They, I feel like there's like it was like one slim two. Well, you know, was, like I feel like the PS one, which was the little baby one, came out after the PS two came out. Yeah, it's something weird like so that. So it's like yeah. the PlayStation. Then right. they made the PS one. Yeah, it was like, it was like PSX or something. PlayStation, then PlayStation two, and then while PlayStation two came out, they made the PS one. Right, right. So I don't know, man. Video games are too complicated now. Well, I don't play them. Yeah, I just I I don't do any. I just buy them and look at them. I, yes, it, this looks nice. I turn them on and listen to the menu music. Bling! Like, yeah, yeah, oh yeah, actually, that's some of them are good. Mm-hmm. What's your favorite video game music? Oh man, um, none actually. I don't like music. I just I play the game with the sound off. Nice. Yeah. What about you? Um. You know, I uh, I asked as a joke. <laughs> <laughs> do you actually and have I one? I don't have an answer. Oh, okay. I, th- I thought you actually did. Um, I was like, weird. If I had to, if I like, had yeah, to, Bass guess. Pro Master sixty four. <laughs> like, I love that music. Game's awful. Um, music is so soothing. Like Parappa the rapper. Right, right. <laughs> um, no, actually, Space Channel number five. I'll tell you. I'll tell you. Uh, it's a tie. Okay. Tony Hawk two and Tony Hawk four. Yeah, four is no joke. Which actually, I feel like doesn't really count because it's real music. Right, right, right. But yeah, it my does. favorite soundtrack is from Guitar Hero one through five. Okay, that's every song that's ever been written. <laughs> oh, Beatles Guitar Hero. Yeah, right. <laughs> I love that soundtrack. It's all good. <laughs> well, yeah, it's. I I made a Spotify playlist the other day that was Tony the Tony Hawk four soundtrack. Oh, it's so fucking. It's awesome, dude. But they don't have everything. There was like some you know Chad Muska like Muska beats you know songs that aren't on Spotify because they were only ever on the soundtrack. I feel like I like the soundtrack to two better. I only ever played really four. Sure. So I can't speak to that. Tony Hawk's been crap. Have they made a new Tony Hawk game in a while? Probably. I mean, I feel like I'd play them. Tony Hawk Aerial Assault. Like it's you know it's probably like crazy now. Yeah. You have guns and you're like. <laughs> Tony Hawk's nine hundred. Tony Hawk little- Black Ops. <laughs> oh okay. I like that. Sign me up. <laughs> Tom Clancy's Tony Hawk Pro Skater <laughs> Delta. <laughs> um, I would. I feel like games are maybe gonna do that eventually. Like, look, we're just running out of stuff. It's the and Doritos really like, Power Bowl. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Championship Series X uh, blue version. How long? This is something I just thought of, and it's a million-dollar idea. Maybe a billion-dollar idea. How long before you play Madden, mm-hmm. you play a season, okay. and you you curate the halftime show? <laughs> oh, Okay. You you design the halftime show as part of your season. That's amazing. I mean, how long t- so that, and then how long till you, and then the winner gets the real halftime show. <laughs> like like there's a contest. You submit your halftime show, and if you win, that's the real halftime show. Oh, you're saying like everyone that plays Madden submits mm-hmm, that. Okay, mm-hmm. how long until that happens? But then like so th- there's already like a you know like 
you're the you're the manager of the team and you build the team up from you know, scratch. How long until you're also like uh, building the city? So you can put the the stadium and like uh, the, you know we have to raise taxes to build a new stadium. Yeah, exactly. So it's like it's a sim city. It's like yeah, you have to. It's Madden within. You have to. You have to like lobby for your city to get the Super Bowl. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. You have to like approach the NFL and be like, look, this is, this is these are the eight reasons why Indianapolis is the city to host the Super Bowl. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Man. And you can, um, but you could like you could like bribe officials or something. So, but if you, but if you get caught though, mm. you get thrown in jail. And then there's a whole like um, break out of jail. Like it's like um, you go, like you splinter go to a cell. Trial. Oh, it's oh, it's like a. <laughs> um, and then you can also you can select your like scandals. You so you you can select a halftime show scandal, obviously, like oh. like Nipplegate. Right, right, right. You can select you know wh- what sort the- of like dog fighting or like <laughs> oh, like sure. um uh, domestic abuse accidental gun discharge in a club yeah um um con- concussions sure, you know yeah, like yeah. you you get to it's all it's all real and then you have to sort of like yeah like uh get to like hire a pr person mm-hmm. have then, press conferences yeah yeah right right and then eventually like that that person or, or people go on to like you know make amends so then you have to design a whole like boys boys and girls club sort of idea or you know like you, how are they giving back to, the community? You have to do community service yeah, yeah yeah but you have to figure out what it is and mm-hmm. and then you have to like construct the, the yeah it's like it's like 40 games in one it's called a life boom smell you later <laughs> How do you be? How do you have been Eddie Murphy at twenty two, and now you're Eddie Murphy at you know fifty or that whatever? That too, yeah. Just stop. Well, you I know? imagine that he like peaked at like twenty eight, yeah, oh, yeah, you know, and then just be like, well, fuck, I don't know. You just stop. I would. You gotta stop. You just gotta fucking stop. Or just do what like Steve Martin does. Yeah. He just doesn't even really do comedy anymore. He's just like, no, I'm, I just play banjo now, yeah. Yeah, and that's, that's true. fine. You just like change it up because you are not gonna be able to be funny forever. You just fucking can't. Yeah, that was weird. No. Norbit was good though. This has been a Peaches and Hot Sauce presentation. Peaches. Hot Sauce. 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 Peaches. Hot sauce.